Now these be the last words of David. David the son of Jesse said, And the man who was raised up on high, the anointed of the God of Jacob, and the sweet psalmist of Israel said, The Spirit of the Lord spake by me, and his word was in my tongue. The God of Israel said, The rock of Israel spake to me, He that ruleth over men must be just, ruling in the fear of God. And he shall be as the light of the morning, when the sun rises, even a morning without clouds, as the tender grass springeth out of the earth by clear shining after rain. Although my house be not so with God, yet he hath made with me an everlasting covenant, ordered in all things, and sure. For this is all my salvation, and all my desire, although he make it not to grow. But the sons of Belial shall be all of them as thorns thrust away, because they cannot be taken with hands. But the man that shall touch them must be fenced with iron, and the staff of a spear, and they shall be utterly burned with fire in the same place. These be the names of the mighty men whom David had, the Tachmanite that sat in the seat, chief among the captains. The same was Adonai the Esnite. He lift up his spear against the eight hundred whom he slew at one time. And after him was Eliezer the son of Dodo the Ehonite, one of the three mighty men of David when they defiled, defied the Philistines that were gathered together to battle. And the men of Israel were gone away. He arose and smote the Philistines until his hand was weary, and his hand clave unto the sword. And the Lord wrought a great victory that day, and the people returned after him only to spoil. And after him was Shema, the son of Agi, Agai, the Herite. And the Philistines were gathered together into a troop, where was a piece of ground full of lentils. And the people fled from the Philistines, but he stood in the midst of the ground, and defended it, and slew the Philistines. And the Lord wrought a great victory. And three of the thirty chief went down, and came to David in the harvest time, unto the cave of Adullam. And the troop of the Philistines pitched in the valley of Rephaim. And David was then in an hold, and the garrison of the Philistines was then in Bethlehem. And David longed, and said, Oh, that one would give me drink of the water of the well of Bethlehem, which is by the gate. And the three mighty men break through the host of the Philistines, and drew water out of the well of Bethlehem that was by the gate, and took it, and brought it to David. Nevertheless, he would not drink thereof, but poured it out unto the Lord. And he said, Be it far from me, O Lord, that I should do this. Is not this the blood of the men that went in jeopardy of their lives? Therefore he would not drink it. These things did these three mighty men. And Abishai, the brother of Joab, the son of Zariah, was chief among three. And he lifted up his spear against three hundred and slew them, and had the name among three. Was he not most honorable of three? Therefore he was their captain. Howbeit he attained not unto the first three. And Benajah the son of Jehoiada, the son of a valiant man of Kebziel, who had done many acts, he slew two lion-like men of Moab. He went down also and slew a lion in the midst of a pit in time of snow. And he slew an Egyptian, a goodly man. And the Egyptian had a spear in his hand, but he went down to him with his staff and plucked the spear out of the Egyptian's hand and slew him with his own spear. These sayings did Benija, the son of Jehoiada, and had the name among three mighty men. And he was more honorable than the thirty, but he attained not to the first three. And David sent him over his guard. Esihel, the brother of Joab, was one of the thirty. Elehan, the brother, the son of Dodo of Bethlehem. Shema, the Hittite. Elikah, the Herodite. Helaz, the Peltite. Ira, the son of Ikesh, the Tekanite. Ebiezer, the Atha, the Anathathite. Muabani, the Hushathite, Zalman the Ehoahite, Harhael the Netophathite, Helab the son of Baana, a Netophathite, Itaiah the son of Rebiah out of Gibeah, Gibeah of the children of Benjamin, Benajah the Parathonite, 
Hedaya of the books of Gaish, Abiel ben the Arbathite, as Mevath the Baramite, Eliaba the Shalbanite of the sons of Jesheth, Jonathan, Shema the Herite, Ahiam the son of Sharara the Herite, Eliphalet the son of Ahazbiah the son of the Machathite, Eliam the son of Ahithophel the Galenite, Hezriah the Carmelite, Pariah the Arbite, Igel the son of Nathan of Ziba, Bani the Gedite, Zelik the Ammonite, Nehari the Birthrite, Armorbearer to Joab the son of Zariah, Ira and Ithrite, Gerab and Ithrite, Uriah the Hittite, thirty and seven in all.